Here we presents the top 5 best Chromebooks. Starting at number 5, Dell Chromebook 3189. Chromebooks are popular with schools because they're easy to use and difficult to infect with viruses. Starting at, Dell's Chromebook 3189 runs Google's operating system, but also bends back into tablet and tent modes, so students can easily use the touchscreen, show classmates what they're working on or interact with Android apps when Google updates its OS to support them. Though this 11-inch laptop doesn't have the strongest performance or brightest screen, the Chromebook 3189's durable chassis, strong audio and all-day battery life make it the best Chromebook for young students. The Dell Chromebook 3189 has a plain, but respectable, gray plastic aesthetic. The cover has a Dell logo in the center, and a Chrome logo in a top corner, while the other top corner has a three-color light that can be used to communicate with the teacher without disrupting the other students. The corners of the computer are rounded and the entire outside edge is covered in a rubberized strip to help protect it from bumps and shocks. The hinges are stiff enough to keep the lid in place as you bend it back into tablet, tender stand modes, but loose enough for a young person to move without straining. The deck carries the same gray aesthetic as the lid. Dell's laptop is a good size for fitting into elementary and middle schoolers' hands and bags. The Chromebook 3189 measures 12x8, 2x0, 9 inches, and weighs 3, 2 pounds. The outer dimensions are about the same as the Asus Chromebook Flip C302 CA, which measures 11, 9x8, 3x0, 6 inches and weighs only 2, 6 pounds, but the C302CAS screen is 1 inch larger than the 3189's. The Acer Chromebook R13 measures 12, 8x8, 9x0, 6 inches and weighs 3, 2 pounds, and has a 13 inch screen. The Dell Chromebook 3180 measures 11, 9x8, 1x0, 8 inches, weighs 2, 8 pounds, and has the same size screen as the Chromebook 3189, at 11 inches. For more information and price, check out the product links in description. At number 4. Acer Chromebook Spin 11. Read our reviews of Lenovo ThinkPads and HP Elite Books, and you'll see boasts of MilSpec 810G compliance, meeting military standards for resisting shock, vibration, extreme temperatures, and other portable PC perils, to reassure buyers concerned about the bumps and bruises of business travel. But forget them. Do you know who really needs MilSpec 810G hardware? Little kids, who'd as soon drop a Chromebook as look at one. The Acer Chromebook Spin 11 carries the certification into the hostile environment of the grade school classroom. It's a 2-in-1 convertible built to shrug off 132 pounds, or 11 ounces or 48 inches, and is our new editor's choice for student Chromebooks. The Spin 11 is made of white polycarbonate plastic with a rubberized beige bumper around its bottom half, giving it a rugged look clearly meant for kids' clumsy hands. Black keys match the large black bezel around the glossy screen. The touch panel that covers the display is antimicrobial Corning Gorilla Glass, designed to resist, not only knocks, and scratches but passing germs from small fingers to classmates and teachers. At 0. 82 by 11. 7 by 8. 1 inches, it's the same size as the Lenovo Flex 11 Chromebook, and a fraction smaller than the Dell Chromebook 3189 Education 2-in-1, and falls between them in weight, with a couple of ounces on each side, at 3. 09 pounds. It flips and folds through the four modes familiar to users of Lenovo Yogas and workalikes like the Assess Chromebook Flip C302 CA regular laptop mode, an easel style stand mode, with the keyboard face down and screen tilted back, tent mode, with the system propped up like an A-frame for poking at touch apps, and tablet mode, with the display and keyboard back to back. Halfway of my listed number 3, Google Pixel Slate. Call me crazy. But Chromebooks should be affordable. That's how I came to love Google's push for a browser-driven, light computing future years ago, and it's how Chromebooks became a staple of school systems everywhere. No doubt about it, Chromebooks are great. I don't know. Google's made bleeding-edge Chrome computers for years, and the Pixelbook a year ago wowed us with an elegant design. The Pixel Slate tries to take on iPad Pro and Microsoft Surface territory by blending tablet and Chromebook into one device. It's the right direction, but the wrong product. As I said after a week of using it, the Pixel Slate is the mirror universe iPad Pro. 
It has a full desktop class browser and support for Bluetooth mice and keyboards with trackpads, which is great. Working on the Pixel Slate, with an optional keyboard, feels like working on a laptop. Sure, Microsoft's been offering the same solution on the Surface, and on countless Windows 10 2-in-1s. Google's Chrome solution has some advantages in Alene OS that starts fast, automatic updates, excellent Google services and Google Assistant on tap, and support for the Google Play Store and Android apps, which run to varying degrees of success on the Pixel Slate. The thin, cleanly designed slate is indeed a blank slate for running a lot of apps, and connecting to a lot of accessories. That's not a new idea, though. And it's not even the first Chrome tablet either, the excellent HP Chromebook X2 is the choice I'd recommend instead, since it has an included keyboard. Coming in at number 2. Lenovo Yoga Chromebook C630. The Lenovo Yoga Chromebook C630 further expands the boundaries of what you can expect from a Chromebook in 2019. The standout feature is a terrific convertible, 15. 6-inch, 4K display, but it also has a complement of solid components and a sturdy, tasteful aluminum chassis. And like most Chromebooks, it costs hundreds less than a similarly configured Windows counterpart. And, in fact, the C630 is the Chromebook version of Lenovo's excellent C930, an editor's choice and one of our all-time favorite two-in-one convertibles. The C930, which runs Windows, can be configured with some higher-end components, and has a few noteworthy extras that the C630 Chromebook lacks. But it also costs a lot more. We tested the top-tier C630 Chromebook configuration which retails. At the time this review was published it was selling, but we've seen Lenovo discount it to closer. In addition to the UHD 4K display, our test unit came with an 8-generation Intel Core i5 to 8250U CPU, 8GB of DDR4 RAM, and a 128GB of AMP storage. That's less firepower than what you'll find on the average Windows machine, but more than potent enough to keep web pages loading fast and apps zipping along on this Chromebook, which is as fast as any we've tested. For more information and price, check out the product links in description. And number 1. Google Pixelbook Go. With the arrival of the Google Pixelbook Go, the Google product line finally has an offering that's affordable to most of us. This is an enticing Chromebook alternative to flagship products like the Google Pixelbook that may be way over your budget, and it's certainly a welcome addition to the roster. The Google Pixelbook Go does come with a few caveats, however. To start, while it's much more affordable than Google's top-of-the-line options, it still isn't the cheapest Chromebook on the market. You're getting less than you'd expect from a machine that isn't in the budget range, a biometric login, for one, is missing from its feature set. Finally, although its entry-level configuration is affordable, the higher ones are more expensive, offering less value for your money. Despite those, the Google Pixelbook Go is an excellent and reasonably priced way to enter the Google product line. It comes with a few features that you won't find in Apple's best offerings, such as a 1080p webcam, impressive battery life, and one of the best laptop keyboards we've ever used. It's no wonder that the Google Pixelbook Go is our editor's choice for Chromebooks. Even if those with the Doe will still find the flagship Pixelbook to be their go-to option, for most of us, the Go is the ideal choice. Still, it should be noted that for just $50 more than the mid-range Pixelbook Go, when it's on sale in the US, you can purchase a 2019 MacBook Air with twice as much storage, a sharper display, better Thunderbolt 3 ports, not to mention the overall allure of a full MacOS system. I have included these product link in the description. You can check out this link for more information and latest price. Thank you for watching this video. Please hit the like button. Share with your friends. And be sure to subscribe.